Now, Harvey Parry was just a baby when he caught a rare form of viral meningitis, which could have killed him, should have killed him, some say, but he hung in there and made it through. Seven months later, he's trying to be a normal toddler, but his illness has cost him both his legs. Now, despite being given prosthetic limbs, he is struggling to use them because they just don't fit properly. His parents are hoping to raise the £10,000 plus that they need to have some special legs made that will get him back on the move. Emma Walden reports on Harvey's campaign. Seven months ago, Harvey Parry's life was changed forever. He was just 15 months old when meningococcal septicemia nearly killed him. He suffered multiple organ failure and his parents were told that he only had a 20% chance of survival. Amazingly, he battled to stay alive but lost both his legs and part of his right hand. Harvey's been to hell and back and he's coped tremendously he's actually kept us going because there's times when I felt that I couldn't keep going anymore with this horrendous thing that's happened to him one week my son was walking to the shops and the next week he didn't have any legs and he's a little soldier with such severe amputations at such a young age Harvey is struggling to cope with the prosthetic limbs supplied by the NHS this is Harvey's third set of legs in the last what five weeks and Unfortunately, they're still not comfortable for him. Um, they're out at the hip, as you can see here. Um, he can't stand up in them. He can't weight bear in them. The material of them is quite rough and is basically rubbing against the scarring of his legs. Harvey's life was saved by the country's leading meningitis experts at St Mary's Hospital in Paddington, where he's still receiving follow-up care. Intense program of plastic surgery is required to rehabilitate these patients. Uh, this can take months of surgery, the patient is left very, very sensitive and even after proper care, the patient has phantom limb pain, they have extreme sensitivities to hot and cold, they have deranged sensation, so it's vital that they have comfortable prosthesis if they are to be properly rehabilitated back to their normal lifestyle. The Paris have already raised £8,000 but need twice that amount for a pair of specialist prosthetic legs for Harvey. I think that Harvey's entitled to the best legs possible for his comfort and ease. And he's 22 months old, he's got his whole life ahead of him. If we can get him the best legs possible to make him feel more comfortable and then we'll be happy as well and Harvey will be happy. And so we're just looking for the best possible for our son like any parent out there would. Having fought so hard for his life, Harvey's already proved he's one very determined little boy. With the right help, he's sure to be unstoppable. Emma Walden, London Tonight, Edmonton.